guys today I just wanted to do this quick haul um it's like midnight and it is Cinco de Mayo and um, I went a couple places today and I just decided I just want to do a haul and show you guys what I got because I got a bunch of different things first I went to Kmart and um, I like to go to Kmart because they carry a bunch of different brands at the same place I think buy one get one half off Milani nail polishes so I picked up the Milani at neon and it's in the color pink rocks and I don't think the color is what the bottle looks like I think it's a little bit more brighter and when you actually apply it but it just looks like this and then I also got the Milani jewel effects and this is in gold and I also have this in the um, red one but I've been wanting the gold one so I got both of those and I think they were like $3.99 and then it was buy one get one half off. They were having buy one get one half off Wet n Wild nail polishes. So I got the um, Wet n Wild Wild Shine. These are the 99 cent ones and this one is in red. Red, red. And I got this because I like to wear red nail polish during the fall because that's when Razorback games are going on and red is our color. So I like to wear those. And this got the um, Cosmo Girl Kiss of Approval. So I knew this had to be good. And these are 99 cents and they are so pigmented. It's crazy. So don't look at these and think they're 99 cents and it's got to be like not very good. They are amazing. I got this one for my mom because like I'm putting together a little thing for her for Mother's Day. And this is in Dream Poppy and I have this myself and I love it. It's like a very pretty coral color. I got my mom the Sweet as Candy Trio, and the other day I put a picture on Instagram of a little haul I got, a bunch of different things, um, and I did get this for myself, and I've been wearing it seriously every day, and I think I'm going to do a eye tutorial using it, but I absolutely love it. These colors are amazing, so um, I got her this because it just looks like something she would like. Then I also picked her up for the little thing I'm going to make her, the Heather Silk Blush, which if you saw my last video of the favorite blushes this is one of them and um I think she'll really like this so and I picked myself up the Rimmel London lasting finish blush this is a blendable powder blush and highlighter and this is an 008 spring or 008 spring flower and the reason I picked this up first of all I've looked everywhere and I can't find this anywhere except for Kmart um but I picked this up because I saw EXO Little Miss Laura her um that's her youtube name and i saw her april favorites and she mentioned this and i don't know she just like i don't know something about it like when she was talking about it i just really wanted to get it myself she said it was like really pretty and really natural looking so i picked it up and i can't wait to try it out i got myself um another wet n wild mega glow illuminating powder um it's Blondie Casey. She got me one in our swap, and I really like it, so I wanted to get another one in a different color palette, and this is like a bronze color, um, and this is in 348 Starlight Bronze, and there's the colors, so it's super pretty. It's just a very bronze color. And I went to Marshalls. First thing I got was I got this Arkansas V-neck t-shirt, and I really like it. I think it's really cute. It's kind of grungy looking. And I love it. And it was $12.99. So I thought that was cute. And then I got, um, this is an American Eagle denim skirt. And it's like a dark wash. It just looks like this. It's like shredded up ends. And this was $12.99. And then I got um, another American Eagle. And it's, it's a light wash. And it's like or whatever you want to call it and this was $12.99 and then I got this romper which okay I'm super short and I'm kind of squatted like my torso short and then I have short legs and I don't know my, I mean, I'm short so I kind of like I've always wanted a romper and I always try them on like forever 21 and all these in nice places nice rompers and they just don't work like they go up my butt because it's just the way my body is it just like doesn't fit there and like I found one that I really liked at Marshall's and I tried it on and it fit and it actually was kind of long like in my bottom area so I was like cool I mean and I've 
liked it a lot. It's really comfy and it's like the best color. It's coral. And so it looks like this a little romper. It's really thin, so it'll be perfect when it gets hot. And then it's got these little ruffles down the middle with these little buttons. So it's super cute. And I have to wear a romper that like bunches because it makes me look like squared. But I really like the color. Um, and the brand of this is. Allie and Chris. So you can probably look it up online because it's all I mean. I don't know. I can't wait to wear that. And then I went to Walmart tonight. I got the Swap Professionals uh, Moisturizing for Dry Damaged Hair. This is the shampoo and it's almond and shea butter. And I used to use Swap so much when I was a kid and I totally forgot about it. It's so cheap. Like this 28 fluid ounce bottle is like $2, but it smells so good. Then I got the Aussie Hair Insurance Leave-In Conditioner. Like I said, Aussie has the best smell. Um, if y'all want me to do like an Aussie video, like on hits and misses, because it's really cheap and some people are like skeptical about some of the products. But um, anyways, I just absolutely love Aussie. Mm -hmm. Got BioTrue Multi-Purpose Solution for contacts. Cetaphil Daily Facial Cleanser. Because I've been seriously working out like in certain places on my face and I don't know why and I think the fact that I'm breaking out like makes me break out more because it stressed me out because I've never broke out and for some reason I am and I don't understand why like I used to not ever wash my face I would just take my makeup off and then like go to bed and I never broke out and now that I like actually am washing my face I'm like breaking out so I don't know, but um, I know Cetaphil is a really good brand for um, acne prone skin, and this is for normal to oily skin. And I got for my mom an EOS balm and strawberry parfait, and then I picked me up some of these little toesy things because I seriously can't paint my toes without getting them on the other toes. So I've been needing to get me some of these. And I got um, the Clean and Clear Advantage Acne Spa Treatment. This is really good, and I've been meaning to get it for a while. I just like have been stubborn. So I'm definitely going to put this baby on my face. I'm dying without my um, my CoverGirl Lash Perfection. It dried out. I mean, like used it all, and I've been dying without it. Like nothing can replace what that mascara can do. <laughs> Seriously, I haven't had it for like a week, and it sucks. So I picked up another one. It was necessary. I'm addicted. This is like my sixth one. So yeah, and this is in the color of Berry Black. My if you watch my favorite blushes, I showed y'all that my hard candy fox in a box was completely shattered and I haven't been wanting to throw it away because I'm like holding on to it. So I remind myself that I need to buy a new one and I did finally. So this is in Spicy and Sweet um, and I'll show y'all what the colors are like. Like I said, it was a baby pink, a coral color, uh, a hotter pink, and then a neutrally brown. Stormy. So the, I'm sorry this light, but then I picked up for my Madre, this is a, a Maybelline Perfect Pastel little duo, and it's in the colors Pink Suede, and it's just got like a, um, a muted, it looks kind of bright on camera, but it's just a muted down pink and then a, a, a medium toned brown. I had a coupon for a Sally Hansen nail treatment um, or a nail thingy, so I picked up the Sally Hansen Advanced Hardest Nails Nylon and Ret Plus Retinol, and it um, it hardens nails and smooth as ridges. Because my fingernails, they can get really long, but they break really easily, and it makes me so mad because I'll have like a bunch of long nails, and then like one finger will be short. So I needed something to um, fix my nails, and there was another one that was like a lot more expensive. But I was being a cheapo and picked up this one instead. It was like three bucks or, and I had a dollar off or something. So I got that. I got another shampoo by Suave and this is Keratin Infusion. And it's, um, it's salon proven to revitalize as well as keratis. And it's a color care shampoo. So it's for color treated and frizzy hair. Um, and it's like the purpley one and the color purpley looking thing. But it smells so good. That's like what got me. I was like, oh my gosh, it smells so good. And this was like a dollar ninety four or something. I'm gonna be using this tonight. I had a coupon for a candle. I have this in the room spray. 
Seaside Spring and Escapes. Febreze is like the bomb. I picked up also because I watched um, XO Little Miss Laura's video. She was talking, okay, she was like, when I first started watching, when I watched that April Favorites, I was like, oh my gosh, she looks so flawless. Her her skin looked flawless. And she said that one of her favorite um, foundations for the month was the Revlon Color Stay. So I had to get it because she looked gorgeous. And this is for normal to dry skin, and I got in 330 Natural Tan. So I can't wait to try that. And two more things. I got the Rimmel London Match Perfection Skin Tone Adapting Concealer. It's a two-in-one concealer and highlighter, and I got in 245 Light because I like my concealers light for under my eyes. And, oh, who? ALH Sander. Ashley Sander was talking about this in, in one of her videos. I think she used it um, in her foundation routine or something, but I love the way it looked. It applied so good. It looked like it had really good coverage, so um, I had to get that. And then I had a coupon for this, but I love the color anyways. It's a L'Oreal Color Rich, color Rich or something, Rich Nail Polish, and this is in 220 I Will. And I love that color. So yeah, that was my um, little haul for the Cinco de Mayo. Um, I hope y'all had a great weekend. Anyway, so if you have any more questions or want to know any more information about any of these products or anything, or you've used any of these and you like them, you hate them, whatever you feel about them, just leave me some comments down below. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, guys. Oh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. And I want to thank all of you guys so much for your support. I am about to reach, or I have reached, 4,000 subscribers, and I'm just like... That's crazy. So um, I'm loving this journey here on YouTube. And I thank all of my supporters, all of my friends here that I've met through YouTube. I'm just so blessed and I, I'm just so grateful for all of y'all. And yeah, I just had to throw that in there because I want y'all to know. So thank you guys so much and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.